Hi, my name is Chris and I am the Certified Lymphedema Therapist at Lunas Masahe. Today, I will be showing you that what you can do at home if you are a breast cancer survivor and have missing lymph nodes in the left side of the, your armpit area. So this, I put the X here, it's because this is the um, sign that this is the area that I have missing lymph nodes. So just assuming this area have a missing lymph nodes. Now we're gonna start how to do the manual lymphatic drainage at home. First, what you can do is we are going to stimulate the lymph nodes, our neck area. We can do 10 to 15 times or however you want to do it. So we're going to go up, down. It's like a circular motion. So what we're doing is this lymph node here above your collarbone and here. So it's a circular motion. So it's a pull and stretch down. 10 to 15 times of those. And we can also do the other side. Next, we're gonna go to our abdomen. We will do deep breathing. We're gonna do nine times starting the, above the belly button so we're gonna go push slightly slightly against our breathing so we're gonna go deep breath by expanding our stomach and push our hands up and slightly push it down according to your breathing After that, we are going to activate the lymph nodes, this area and this area, because the fluid that are built up in this area, since there is no lymph nodes here that can filter all the fluid, this one is blocked. We are going to push this fluid here and push the fluid down there, okay? So this is called anastomosis so first what we're gonna do is we're going to do activate the lymph nodes here so we're going to clear this area and then after that we're going to clear this area so again it's 10 to 15 times you can do more but at least 10 to 15 times okay so it's a circular motion Then we go to the other side. So it's the inguinal area, the crest of your inguinal. So you go inward. Ten to fifteen times. You can do more if you want. After you clear that area, you're going to start clearing the pathway. So this is the bridge. First, we're going to clear the area close to the area where you're going to drain the fluid. So go up and go to the side. So it's like pull and stretch to the skin. 
So you need to be on the skin while you're doing it. You can do seven times in the same spot. So pull up and stretch to the side. Up and stretch direction to the area where you're going to drain the fluid. Then move seven times or more. Then move. Now that is clear. You're ready to move the fluid in that area. Now we are going to clear this area too. So this is the pathway for the fluid here going to this area. So we are also going to clear this area close to the lymph nodes first. So the stroke, no pressure, is going to be pull and stretch. No pressure. 7 to 10 times or more. Now you can start clearing those fluid. They're already clear. This is clear, this is clear. Now we're gonna start clearing the fluid. So first, this fluid right here, this fluid right here, just get, if there's swelling right here, we have to bring this fluid this side. But before that, well, let's clear this side first. Now this side is clear. So we're going to take this swelling, the fluid, to this. So this is our gutter. So we go up and go to that side. You can do more, 10 to 15 times if you want. So that one is clear. You already moved the fluid. Now you are ready to move the fluid this way. You can alternate based on your comfort. You can spend a lot of time there here. You can repeat seven times or more. So remember, no pressure, just pull and stretch. When you're done with that, this thing right here, we're going to drain it to this inguinal. The swollen in this area, we're going to drain it to this inguinal. So, so we already cleared it. It does not hurt to clear it again. Then you can start directing the fluid, fluid where it's supposed to go.
So the stroke is pull and stretch. No pressure. It's a pull, pull and stretch. Then after you do that, and you do that, you're going to activate the lymph nodes again. If you want. Then go back to the breathing. Nine times. That's what you can do, lymphatic drainage at home, for your home care, if you are missing lymph nodes and you have swelling in your left area. Now, if the right area is the one it's affected, it's the same direction, it's the same technique, but you just go drain it to the different direction. So, instead of this, you're going to work on this one, and you're going to work on this. So, you're going to drain that way and it's the same strokes in the neck and the stomach this is chris again certified lymphedema therapist at lunas masahe thank you for watching if you like the video click like share and subscribe for more videos thank you